Moving on with our stories in the Prime Time News package, the OECS Regional Coordinating Mechanism hosted a capacity training over Thursday and Friday in an effort to increase oversight of the OECS current grant on HIV and TB elimination. The workshop, which is part of a program supported by Global Management Solutions, was targeted at the Dominica Country Coordinating Mechanism and the civil society organizations involved in the National AIDS Response. Director of the OECS RCM, Joan Didier, explained that the program aimed to target those most vulnerable to the disease. The Global Fund grant that we were, that we were approved for in 2016 was for a total of 5.02 million US dollars. That grant focuses on the elimination of HIV and TB in the OECS, and it also focuses on ensuring that civil society organizations, particularly organizations that work with the key populations of men who have sex with men, sex workers, and transgendered persons, are able to access treatment and care and other services for HIV, STI and TB. And Didier explained that the workshop currently taking place aims to give insight into oversight, ensuring that those responsible for oversight of the funds are equipped to do their job properly. So really what's going on here is giving individuals an insight into what oversight is. They are supposed to be involved in oversight of the grant. Is the grant being used for what it is supposed to be used for? Are the civil society organizations that are supposed to be getting the capacity building, are they getting that? Right, so that is basically what we're doing here today. And did they also explain that similar workshops had taken place in all participating member states, including Antigua and Barbuda, St. Vincent and the Grenadines, Grenada, St. Kitts, and later this year, one will be held in St. Lucia. The overarching goal of the program is to reduce the incidence of HIV in accordance with the HIV 90-1990 target and achieve TB elimination in accordance with the TB elimination framework for low-incidence countries.